In my case, you can deposit funds into a client's trust account and then apply those funds later onto an invoice of your designation. We will go over the two different ways you can deposit funds into a client's trust. The first is to record an offline payment made into the trust. You'll navigate to the Billing tab and then click on the icon for Deposit into Trust. The Deposit into Trust light box will appear and you will be asked to select the contact that you would like to deposit the trust funds for. Either type in the name into the box or choose to browse all and view a list of all active clients and companies that are in your MyCase account. Once you have selected a contact, you can then record the deposit into their trust account. First, choose the payment method, choose the date of the payment, amount, and any notes that you would like to include. Then click Deposit Funds. The deposit will be made into the contact's account, thus increasing your trust account balance. You can also make trust deposits from your contact's details page. To do this, find the contact's details page that you would like to deposit trust funds for. Then click on the Billing tab. You will then see the full trust history for your contact. You can deposit more funds into their trust from this view. You can export the trust history into a PDF, and you can also reflect any refunds or withdrawals from the trust at this page as well. The second way is to accept an online payment from your client into the trust. You will need to have our MyCase Payments platform enabled to utilize this feature. Once you have the payments platform, you can send your clients invoices through the client portal so they can pay you directly into trust. Please note, in order to share invoices and more through MyCase, you need to ensure that your contact has the client portal enabled in the contact details page. We will then create an invoice and add a flat fee for the desired trust deposit and scroll to the very bottom of the invoice editor page where we will see the ability to share this invoice with the contacts linked to this case. Once you click the Share checkbox next to your client's name, you will then see a drop-down menu on the right of the page where you can choose which bank account you'd like the online payments for this transaction to be made into. In this case, if it is a trust deposit or replenishment, we will be sure to choose Trust Account. After we save the invoice, your client will receive an email alerting them of a new invoice in their client portal. They can log in and choose their preferred payment method, whether credit card or e-check, to pay the invoice. Once they make that electronic payment, both the invoice and their trust history will be immediately updated. 